hi guys happy sunday um we're here for the glow we've come for the glow i have literally done nothing but hit the couch this weekend my vitamin d levels came back from my doctor super duper crazy low so i'm on a ridiculously high supplement of like 50,000 milligrams a week until we get it up high enough but that explains why I've been feeling terrible the last couple of weeks and it's all the vitamin D levels so that's why I haven't been as active on here because I've literally just been exhausted all the time so if you're feeling super glum no energy, brain fog, all those things, go and see about getting your vitamin D levels checked because it's very common this time of year to have super low levels. Um, all right, so we're gonna do a little makeup. Hi, Abby. When you guys uh, hop on, say hi so I know you're here. Let me know where you're tuning in from. Um, we're gonna hop on with a little bit of makeup primer first and then I'll show you what else we're using today. But this primer is the best. Everything that I'm using, look at that, just one pump and you're good to go. Hi, Larissa. Um, Everything that I'm using today is going to be Arbonne. Everything is non-toxic. Everything is vegan, soy-free, dairy-free, non-GMO, um, not tested on animals, all of those really important things. Paraben-free, good for your skin, all of the things. Hi, Abby. Uh, Old Forge PA, hello. Hopefully it's warmer there than it is here. It's so cold here right now. And... Um, this is this is probably also adding to my bad mood. Um, my sister-in-law just got engaged last weekend, and so they're planning their wedding for next spring, and she lives in Southern California, so I've been looking on VRBO at all the houses um, for when we go out next year for the wedding, and let's just say looking at the houses in like San Clemente, California versus what's out my window right now is definitely depressing. Nope, it's freezing here. <laughs> hi, Laura. Hi, Mary. Hi, Kelly. Um, so yeah, I've been on VRBO, basically just stalking out all the different rental properties that we could stay at. And I, I've i never been to California before, so I'm super excited. Hi, Liz. All right, so we're going to do, I've been using a lot of BB cream lately, but I don't want to bore you guys with using the same things over and over again. So I'm going to use just foundation today, and I'm going to use the shade um, Honey Beige to do my makeup. Um, our foundation is, again, all the non-toxic, all of that kind of goodies, um, but it goes on so beautifully. Um, hi, Chels. It's really kind of incredible how it corrects your current complexion without totally masking it and making it look like something it isn't. Um, so I just put one pump on, start with one pump. You can see that it kind of runs down my hand a little bit because it is a looser foundation. And I'm just gonna high mush. I'm just going to put it on my skin so that we can blend it out. Hi, Tara. So um, the there's a great 18-piece makeup kit on my website that you can get. Um, this month, when you get that kit, you also become a preferred customer for free, which means that you get 20 to 40% off the website for a year, free shipping, a free full-size gift every time you have a $150 order. Um, just really great kind of perks. But if you're looking to move your makeup over to non-toxic makeup, that's a great way of getting an entire makeup kit for an incredibly discounted price. Do I just send you a picture to color match me? Yes. Um, send me a picture facing a window so I can see your neck and your face. You can have makeup on or not. Totally up to you. Um, but as long as you're standing in front of an open window so that I get that good lighting, I should be able to tell what it is. And let me know if you're just looking for foundation. Um, usually I tell people that I will, um, I'll give them like a foundation, a primer, and like a highlight contour routine. But if you're just interested in one or the other, that's totally fine too. Hi, Stephanie. All right, so this is an Eco Tool sponge. This is just a makeup sponge. I get these at Target or on Amazon. Um, every time I use this, I wash it with hot water and hand soap just so it gets this squishiness and it's got a little bit of dampness on it. This helps blend your makeup out so nicely. It's a step that I never, ever, ever neglect to take. And <clears throat> it also keeps your skin nice and clean by not taking bacteria and putting it back on your skin. Hi, Charlene. So we're just gonna bounce this like this right on my skin and look at how beautifully that blends out literally it's effortless I've used a lot of foundations in my day 
but honestly, I have to fool with this the least. It just like, it takes your skin, accepts it, and like beautifies it. Look at that. It still looks like my skin, but it's not like that chalky, phony consistency. And I think that's what I love the most about it. I was actually looking at a lot of pictures lately while I was messing with my hair to kind of just like, <clears throat> you know, you kind of look at where you were a year ago, where you are today. And I was like, wow, I kind of look like I'm wearing a lot less makeup lately. And I think it really is just this makeup looks more natural, period. I just couldn't run with the 25-year-olds uh, anymore. You know what I mean? I had to start acting my age a little bit. Okay, so we're good with foundation. Super easy, great color match. This is the Honey Beige. Um, <clears throat> I use a I use two different foundations a lot of times. I'll also go to the Soft Blush because I'm super pale right now. But I like the way that the Honey Beige gives me just a little bit more pink in my skin um, because I'm super duper pale this time of year. Hi, Christine. And we're finally over the plague of 2020 that hit this house. Thank goodness. Okay, so I am going to use our Sitting Pretty Translucent Setting Powder because I'm going to use a pressed powder on my under eyes today just to kind of vary things up for you a little bit. And I love this Translucent Setting Powder because A, it smells like cupcake batter, but B, you can kind of see in here, it's got like a soft pearlescent shimmer to it. So it makes your skin look like it's glowing, even though it's not changing the color of anything. So I just buff a little bit of this into my skin with a brush and let it set. And this is gonna make your foundation stay perfect all day long. And this also comes in the 18 piece makeup kit. So much comes in that. And I haven't even told you about, that. oh, also we have two skincare sets this month that are on super sale, the R9 and the um, Biohydria line. So if you have super dry skin, both of them are phenomenal, but I'm in love with, I use a couple of products from both, but I'm thinking of jumping in and getting like one full product line and just going to town on it because I'm so in love with it. All right, so this is a pressed powder. This does not come in the 18 piece makeup kit, I got this individually. This is the shade light, and I'm gonna use this as an under eye highlight, just like I would in the previous makeup that I was using. So this is the shade light, it's a pressed powder foundation, and I'm just gonna kind of press it on my under eyes and use it in the areas that I wanna highlight and brighten. And just kind of like bump up that coverage, make my under eyes appear brighter. I won't look so tired then. And on my chin. Hi, Jennifer. And I love this, especially if you have an oily T-zone. I do not, I have combination skin, but I'm more like normal to dry than I am normal to oily. But if you have an oily T-zone, you're definitely gonna love adding a little pressed powder to that area of your face. Okay. So we're gonna use bronzer now. This bronzer comes with the 18 piece makeup kit. It comes in one color, so you don't have to worry about that, but we do have this beautiful glow palette, which has bronzer, blush, and highlight shades in it. And this will last you forever. But we're gonna use the bronzer. And what a great shade of bronze is that? Like literally, it's so perfect. It's such a nice, cool, even brown. It doesn't make you look like muddy or like way too orange, but look at the difference between the side of my face that's contoured and the side that isn't. It's just everything. And you're just gonna kind of feel where your cheekbone is. It starts at the top of your ear. You're gonna feel for that hollow in your cheek and then just kind of like blend down towards the corner of your mouth. So I'm gonna go on my temples. And just blend it in down the sides of my nose. Oh God, I feel human again. I should have done this earlier, but I didn't want to get off of the couch. It's literally been struggle bus central over here. 
Hi, Debbie. Um, if you've never had super low vitamin D, I'm telling you right now, it's literally like someone opened up a main artery and just drained you. It, I have not been this tired since I brought home a newborn, honestly. So if you're feeling that way, if you're having like brain fog, if you're having any of those things, get your vitamin D levels checked. All right, perfect. Oh, there I am. You know when your reflection in the mirror just does not match how you feel? That's always a sad day here. All right, let's throw a little bit of blush on. I'm gonna go in with this really pretty shade, which is called Blossom. Gorgeous. It's sort of like a pink with a little bit of like an apricot hue to it. And I'm just seriously so in love with it. And I don't know, should we do eyeshadow or should we just blend some blush and highlighter and bronzer into our eyes? Hi, Nicole. blush is good okay so we have two different things that we can pick from for eye looks this is eyeshadow palette one how did i do that eyeshadow palette one which you comes in the 18 piece makeup kit you can pick from palette one or palette two or i can just go in with my glow palette and do my eyes with that i feel your pain with a 17 month old baby and a month old baby i'm exhausted which is why i need to buy fizz oh my god you're gonna love the fizz you're good. It's like, I feel like the fizz, where did that go? Um, I feel like the fizz should go home with new moms at the hospital. Like it's, li it's literally such a lifeline. I have not had the fizz in a few days only because I've literally just been laying on the couch feeling sorry for myself ever since I got this vitamin D deficiency thing. I have just been chugging water because they told me I was super dehydrated too. So um, I just have to get back on my routine, but there's really no excuse. I should know better. Um, are we going to use <clears throat> the glow palette or are we going to use the eyeshadow palette to do eyes? Somebody tell me what we're doing because you guys call the shots here. So this is totally like Kim Kardashian beauty vibes and then this is like super simple JLo vibes. This comes with the kit. This is glow palette. Glow palette it is, Chelsea. Okay, so what's great about the glow palette is you get basically this whole J-Lo vibe. It doesn't come in the 18-piece kit, but it's really, really affordable. And this is huge. It will literally last you forever. All right, so perfect. So I'm going to go in with the shade Meteor, this one right here. And I'm going to blend it right into my eyeshadow crease. And that's the shade Meteor, that dark brown one. This is like my mom go-to look when I'm not trying to be too extra, but I just need like a little something on to go to work. I want to look polished, but I don't want to look super extra. This is my go-to. Hi, Alyssa. All right, and now we're going to go in with the shade... What is this? Moonstone, this really pretty pink. And I'm just going to blend that all over my lid. If you were going on vacation, you could literally just get away with taking something like this, a mascara, a lip product, and some CC cream with you and be done with it. All right, and then I'm going to take Stardust with my finger. And I'm just going to pop it on my lid and in the inside corner of my eye. So if anyone, like we were talking about, if anyone is a Southern California expert, San Clemente area, let me know um, because we're going to be there next spring for my sister-in-law's wedding and I cannot wait. I've never been to California before, so I'm really excited to go out there and kind of like see all that it is. I've heard a lot, but I've never actually been out there. There is a highlighter brush. All right, so I'm going to take that same shade called Stardust and I'm just going to build that right up here on the top of my cheekbones and you can see the glow already from that. Hi, Kimberly. If you're feeling a little less glowy, this star, this palette right here, the glow palette will literally give you 
new life into your lock. I'm just gonna throw a little bit of that dark shade, that meteor, right on my lower lash line. And then I'm gonna add a little bit of liquid liner, I think, to the top. Get a little drama. Okay. So let's do a little liquid liner, and I wanted to use that really pretty shade that I just got, Arbor. Okay, so this Arbor shade is gorgeous. It's a dark chocolate brown, and this liquid liner is so easy to use. And I do pull my, this is like totally, if you watch people show you how to do an actual makeup tutorial, they will tell you never pull your eye. I don't know how people just draw on their eyes and not poke themselves in the eye. So I always pull my eye to the side in order to get a straight line. You could pull a thousand makeup artists and they would all tell you it's wrong now. But that's how I do things. So this shade is called Arbor. It's like a dark chocolate brown. Everything is hypoallergenic. So if you have sensitive eyes like I do, you don't have to worry about this irritating your eyes. Hi, Allison. Hi, Ashley. Hi, Alice. How's everybody? All right, so now we're gonna go in with Speaks Value Mascara. We also have a mascara that's a waterproof mascara and right now it's on sale until tomorrow and it's like 60% off, so it's like $11 or something like that. Um, everything's hypoallergenic, so if you have sensitive eyes, definitely take a look at it. I think I'm gonna buy a couple of them, um, you know, just to have on hand type of a thing. How are you feeling? I am feeling okay, Allison. Thank you for asking. Um, I'm finally over whatever it was that the kids gave me. So I went to the doctor on Thursday and they drew my blood and they found out that I am dangerously vitamin D deficient. So um, that's happened to me one time before, but apparently my levels are even lower now than they were over the summer. So I'm on a 50,000 milligram vitamin D pill once a week and that should get me back up within normal range to just take an everyday supplement. And then I have to go back in 12 weeks and get my vitamin levels tested again. But apparently this time of year, it's not rare, especially for people up here to be vitamin D deficient because we're not outside at all because it's cold and I don't do outside in the cold. Um, but yeah, I feel a little bit better. I thought, honestly, I thought I was depressed. I thought that like everything with my dad had just finally caught up with me. Um, I thought I was just super foggy and having trouble sleeping and not motivated and exhausted because of that. But apparently all of those things are um, side effects of vitamin D deficiency. So who knew? If you guys are feeling like that, go get your vitamin levels checked. You never know. All right, I'm obsessed with this Speaks Volume mascara. It pulls my lashes through so nicely that I never have that like chunky eyelash look. I love this wand. And I'm just gonna take what's left over on it and do my lower lashes really quick. Okay, oh, there I am. All right, so brow pencil. I'm going to go in with medium brow pencil. And this comes in the 18 piece makeup kit, the brow pencil and the brow gel. So I'm just gonna take this medium pencil and I'm just going to draw top line. This pencil is super duper easy to use. I will say though, if you think that your light go medium, if you think that your medium go dark, because I feel like um, they're very, very true to their color. And with brows, you always wanna go just one step slightly darker. They're all very natural, but that's medium. What I think I love the most about it is it's like impossible to end up with a phony looking eyebrow. You know, the ones that look like stickers <laughs> that totally freak me out. But we're not done with the brows yet. Let me show you something. 
All right, so I'm just gonna take the spoolie on the end and brush my brows upwards. Okay. And then we're gonna use the brow gel. So the brow gel I got in the shade light medium. And what I love about this is it holds your brows in place all day long. So if you look on Pinterest at like eyebrows or models that have like close up photos, you're gonna notice that their brows look like they're very well groomed and brushed upwards. And that's because they use brow gel to do that. So I'm obsessed with this and it makes your brows look nice and full just because you're able to take a little bit of pigment and brush them up. Literally everything. Came out a little hot right there. Fix it, fix it. Take a little bit of that pressed powder. Just clean up that forehead a little bit. Okay, so let's do lips. I got this new lip product that I've been dying to use. So I'm actually gonna take an eyeliner called, what is this one? Is this Morel? This is Morel. So this really pretty, this is actually an eyeliner, but I liked it because it was the perfect nude lip liner. So I'm gonna take Morel and line eye lips with it. And yes, this does lean a little bit brown, but don't worry. It's better that it leans a little brown than a little red, in my opinion. Okay, so eyeliner in the shade Morel. And then this is <clears throat> a lipstick and a lip gloss in one. Hi, Katie. Hi, Devin. So we're going to start with, what shade is this? Jasmine. Lip, lip lipstick with a jasmine lip gloss. So I find these to be super cool. So we're gonna start with the darker pink. I love that it's a two in one and we're gonna blend it right into that lip liner. Gorgeous. Oh my God, I love this color. Especially with the Morel eyeliner on there. So a nice pretty pink. And then we're going to take the other side, which is the gloss. Oh my God, it tastes so good. It literally tastes like vanilla frosting. All right, loving that. Love, love, loving that. This jasmine is everything. If you're looking for a gorgeous shade for spring, I love that it's a two-in-one situation happening here. Okay, so another thing that I got that is not in the 18-piece makeup kit, but I love it so much, is this spray, um, finishing spray. So... It's a little bit deceiving. This is this felt small to me when I got it. So I compared it to the product I had been using before and it's the same fluid ounces. It's just that the, the packaging on the previous thing I had been using is literally double the size because it's only half filled. So um, Arbonne is very, very environmentally conscious. So you're gonna notice that the packaging is really condensed. Things seem smaller. It's literally the same quantity of product that you're getting with other things. It's just that they're not fooling you with these huge compacts. They're actually giving you a real volume that's deeper instead of one that's spread out so it looks larger. Anyway, this setting spray is amazing. I'm just gonna give it a little shake. Oh my God, and it smells like peppermint. It's so good. All right, so I will take an after selfie, but I'm literally, I love this makeup so much. Um, I know that, you know, you're probably listening to this and going, well, she sells it, she's gotta say that. 
it has changed my skin. It has changed the way I look at my skin so much. Instead of covering my skin, instead of covering me and making me look like somebody I'm not, what it's done is just enhance my features. Um, I never have like a reaction to it. Nothing ever gets itchy. Nothing ever flakes and falls off halfway through the day. I'm just so pleased with it. So if you guys want to get color match, if you have any questions about skincare, um, we have two incredible skincare lines right now that are more than 50% off. Plus you get a free gift. Plus you get the year long 20 to 40% off discount on the website for anything else you need. So if you want to start with skincare and throw in a couple of makeup items, you can absolutely do that. And then you can always count on getting 20 to 40% off the makeup for a full year. The 18 piece makeup bundle is amazing if you're looking to um, either purchase a whole bunch of makeup or start over from scratch with clean makeup products. It's so good. Hi, Jen. Hi, Kristen. Um, so if there's anything that you guys have questions on or you just want to look at it, ask me. I can color match you. You can look at all the products. Um, super good. Super, super good. I'm actually going to hop on and order a couple new shades so that these can continue to be interesting videos and not the same makeup all the time. But I love you guys. Thank you so much for checking in on me and watching these videos. If you would, I would so appreciate if you would network this video around, throw it up on your wall, send it to a girlfriend, anything like that. If you guys want to ever have a virtual party with Arbonne, you can earn um, hostess rewards for free nutrition, skincare, makeup, baby products, skincare products, all that kind of stuff. We have all of that. So um, don't think that Arbonne is just makeup. It's a lot of different things. Hi, Jessica. Hi, Rosie. Thank you. Um, so it's a lot of different things. It's helped me a lot sort of get a handle back on my eating after my eating went off the rails. Um, the protein powders, the fizz sticks, the detox tea, just really good stuff for you. Everything is super clean. It abides by the European standards. Everything is plant-based and um, just really good good for you. So I will take a selfie and I'll list all the products that I used. Um, if you guys have any questions, just let me know. Otherwise we'll be at Home Depot, you know, doing, doing that suburban, suburban mom thing, but throw this up, give it a share, give it a like, give it a comment. I would really appreciate it. And I will see you guys back here on Tuesday. Mwah.